closing in on election day, something Hawaii's eligible voters often greet with a simple ho hum. Low voter turnout has plagued the Aloha State for years. KITV Force Pete Cajano examines why that is and possible ways to get people to vote. Hawaii, first in fun and sun, near last place when it comes to voting. I talked to residents today and posed a very simple question. Will you vote this November? Yes, I am. Still debating. Undecided. And that very unscientific poll goes pretty hand in hand with the ones produced by the pros at the U.S. Census Department. Only about one in two citizens will likely vote in the November election. That's based on 2012 data indicating a 52% citizen voting rate, second to last in the nation. This number has big implications. It's hurting poor people. It's, it's uh, hurting people who don't have a voice and don't have influence in, in politics. Um, and it's hurting people who are not very well educated. Analysts say politicians tend to serve those who help put them into office, and those who don't vote may not get attention. The state has made some attempts to turn out more voters. And I'm here in Honolulu Hale, one of the many locations opening early tomorrow in an effort to draw in more voters. But so far, that has not been enough. There are many reasons experts theorize for the lower turnout, one of which, lack of competitive elections. And over time, as the Democratic Party emerged, as by far the strongest uh, party and if we've become really a dominant one party state and there have been a lot of elections even at the national you know first house and senate then and, and even for governor which are not very competitive that may reduce the, vo the voter turnout this may not be easy to change but some other factors that affect turnout may be possible to skew early voting is a start but experts say more can be done one is making it as easy as possible to register for voting. There's a correlation between higher voter turnout and same-day registration. Something that will be coming to Hawaii in 2018 as legislation has been passed which will allow for day of registration. Until then, it's expected Hawaii will be near last place when it comes to voting. And it's worth noting it wasn't always this way. For the decade following statehood, Hawaii consistently ranked near the top in the nation for voter participation.